What's up guys, Demon Monkey here, and today I've got a sick uh, video for you. Yeah, a sick video for you. So it's another one of those cancerous reviews. Um but today's is a I don't even know what to call it because it's really, really strange. It's um this weird woman who uh some of you might have heard of. Her name is Cassidy Boone. Now if you haven't heard of her, she is a absolute retard. Um, the story of hers is that she got saved from drowning, okay, so she was drowning, and then she got saved and resuscitated by a guy. Now, in many people's eyes, that guy is a hero, okay, he saved some woman's life. But in her eyes, he raped her, and now she's suing him, okay? So we're gonna take a look at the video that she uploaded to YouTube about this topic. Let's get straight into it, no fucking around, hell nah. Hi guys, my name is Cassidy Boone, and today I'm going to be talking about something, like, really important. It's really hard for me to talk about this, and I've only told a few people, but I feel like it's my responsibility to spread awareness because this sort of thing happens every day. Some of you may have already read the article that I wrote about this the other day, but I wanted to make a video because it just felt so much more personal and I thought it would get the message across a little better. So pretty much straight off the bat, this is just this is this is Cassidy Boone, right? She announces her name and says different things. Um but uh after this little clip, she's gonna get into the actual story and uh I've stopped it here to just warn you, you might get triggered during the showing, okay? I'm this this will probably give you epilepsy, even though there's no flashing colors or lights. You will just boom epilepsy. Okay, so um, yeah, let's just uh carry on and uh, don't say I didn't warn you. Okay. So anyway, a few weeks ago, I almost drowned. I was at this lake having my first swim of the summer. There is this like jumping platform thingy that everybody was jumping off, so I thought. What the hell, I might as well try it too, it looked like fun. Apparently, I hit my head on the way down, and I was knocked unconscious. I woke up lying on my back, back up on the platform, with a whole bunch of people standing around me, and this weird 40-year-old something, 40-year-old guy, like, pressing down on my chest. At first, I had no idea what was going on. But then the man who had revived me told me that I had been underwater for almost two minutes. He said that he had been lucky to get a hold of me down there. A small part of me was happy to be alive, but the rest of me was screaming inside. So, yeah, this is where it kind of starts getting weird. I mean, she's explaining uh, how everything happened. You know, she hit her head on the way down, and she went down into the water, obviously, and she was down there for almost two minutes. This guy swam in, you know, rescued her, and, yeah, and resuscitated her, and, you know, helped her stay alive. Now, she says that part of her was happy that he had done it. Part, part of her was, you know, like, feeling, you know, grateful that he had saved her life. But most of her, so, I don't know, like, you know, she doesn't give percentages or nothing, but most of her was screaming inside, okay? How could you not be happy that this this guy has just saved your life? Okay, so I'm I'm getting the picture that of uh, you know her kind of wanting to die. Okay, so if if she wants to die so bad, I, you know what? We might as well just, just like order a hitman on her and just you know, but uh, a hitman who's uh, not a hitman. He's a she's a hit woman. Okay, because a hit woman, no, 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 a hit woman couldn't rape her. Oh no, 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 no. The hit woman would kill her, but then she'd sue her for rape, even though she's a w anyway, right? Lesbian rape, hell yeah. So yeah, this, this is just this is just freaking weird. Okay, so she's she's uh, uh she's kind of happy that he helped her, but more importantly, she's pissed off that he saved her life. Let's continue, okay? I can't believe he just felt that he had the right to just grab me under the water while I was knocked unconscious. I wasn't able to consent. 
He thought it was perfectly okay to just grab my body and pull me in whatever direction that he pleased. He possessed my body, and he grabbed my waist and pulled me around down there like it was his right, like he wanted to fucking have sex with me down there in the water. Fucking aquatic sex. I feel so violated. I can't believe it. He raped me. Fucking aquatic sex. So, yeah, I, I, I really don't have any words for this. Um, she's, she's complaining that, you know, he had, he wanted to have sex with her and he wanted to do this to her and he wanted to do that to her. And, you know, she was, she, I mean, towards the end she was crying and then she said, he's going to, he wanted to rape me or he raped me. And, and that's a big statement to say because, you know, he didn't actually physically, uh, you know, rape her. I mean, he didn't do anything. And what he did was pick her up from underneath the water, right? Now, you know, that sounds kind of bad. But if you if you think about it in this way, she is drowning. She has she's been under the water for almost two minutes. He has swum down to where she is. He has dragged her fat ass out of the water, right? onto the side of the swimming pool where he has proceeded to resuscitate her to keep her alive and when she wakes up he's there with a crowd of people and then she she blames him of raping her they, they, this is just she's just wrong I mean it, it is I hope she doesn't win this this suing or whatever because it seriously really is is like is bad okay? Uh, I'm gonna end the video here because she does go on for quite a little while and the jump cuts are starting to piss me off too. The amount of jump cuts is in there. I mean, I really hope this girl is joking, but sometimes it, I mean, it doesn't. Um, in, in a later clip, she says that her dad, you know, has hired a really good lawyer. So her dad is on her side as well. I mean, guessing his dad, I mean, why wouldn't he be on his side? But still, it's just really, really retarded and I'm not gonna show you the full video because I just, I, I just can't even fucking mentally handle any of this anymore. So, I'm gonna just gonna go kill myself. Dad, get the rope! I'm going to kill myself, okay? I don't care what you say. No, okay? I'm going to kill myself. But, no, Dad, leave the rope. You know what? We're gonna... We're gonna... Ju just get the car ready. Um, and then, as soon as I tell you to open your door and jump out... Uh, uh, yeah, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die by, I'm gonna steal the car. No, you know what? Just forget about it. I'm, I'm just gonna kill myself by cutting my wrists off. You know what? I'm, I'm tired about that joke. I mean, that, that joke's fucking gay, isn't it? It's fucking gay. Anyway, I'm ending it here because I'm getting triggered by this video for starts and shit like that. So... Yeah, uh, the link to the full video I'll leave in the description if you do want to watch the full video and want to comment on a fucking thing. Listen here, fat bitch, we're going to stab you, boy. But spell it all wrong because you're like fucking five years old. So yeah, I've been the Meddy Monkey, guys. You guys can call me Spunky Monkey. If you like the video, leave a like. If you dislike the video, dislike. If you want to uh, leave me some uh, hate comments, just go a fucking head. See how I care. I do care. Um... And then, yeah, so I've been to Monkey Guys, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya!